The 9,000 square foot mansion situated on five acres of land at 14740 Keel Street in King City, Ontario was custom built in 1995 for British businessman George Fayer. Fayer moved to Canada in the 90s and founded a business selling kit car parts titled Canadian All-Terrain Vehicle Manufacturing Company. The company had several non-compliance issues and was dissolved in 2004. The business was co-owned by George's son, Robert Fair, who also lived in the residence but later moved back to the UK to start a new business venture. In 2008, the founder of a moving company bought the home and lived in it with his four children, three sons and one daughter between the ages of 8 and 17. In 2012, he listed the house with Martin Sheikin of the Remax Performance Realty Inc. This is when the YouTube video showing photos of the house was made. The six bathroom, five bedroom house sold for approximately $1.7 million in late 2012 to a real estate investor. The investor never took residence in the home, instead choosing to obtain a license to grow medical marijuana. This caused a fair bit of concern with neighbors who complained about the dangers of growing marijuana inside a home. A neighboring community had a public meeting to discuss mitigating the exposure of marijuana to children on Wednesday, February 11th, 2015. In the early morning hours of Thursday, February 12th, 2015, just a few hours after the public meeting, a fire in the foyer of the home was reported to local authorities. The cause of the fire was never publicly released, although it is suspected to be an electrical fire. No charges were laid and the property was abandoned. That is all that is known about the home for sure. I suspect if the fire was caused by the electrical system, the owner would have realized the property was no longer viable as a marijuana growing facility and that would explain why the smoke damage was never fixed and the house was no longer cared for. This would also make obtaining insurance for the house very hard and likely not worth it to the owner. Shortly after, an explorer by the alias Drifting Pablo discovered the home was empty, it became a coveted top secret location for urban explorers, with only a few people posting images from the pristine home in August of 2015. Around the summer of 2016, the real estate listing was found and publicly shared on social media, which began the steady decline of the location. By the time November of 2016 came around, the location had made its way onto YouTube. With careless explorers giving full address details to anyone and everyone, this was the beginning of the end for 14740 Keel Street. This is also supposedly when the rumors and clickbait stories began popping up, including the popular old lady with cancer and drug dealer grow up stories that gave the mansion its now infamous title of illegal grow up mansion. In December of 2016, the entire home was boarded up, although this didn't stop vandals from prying off the boards, breaking windows, and spray painting hate speech and racial slurs on the walls. The couches were thrown down the stairs and all remaining glass inside was broken and shattered. By 2017, the home was unrecognizable. In March, the iconic clamshell tub was broken. The lid hauled out to the front foyer and thrown over the railing, slamming to the floor below. Finally, by the end of March, 14740 Keel Street was demolished.